hi guys welcome to another video as you can see by the title of the video is how to trade in line with market structure so i have two scenarios around here and they are picture perfect you have your buy trend around here and then you have your sell trend around around here so let's focus like on the buy trend around this area here and then an uptrend you can see it or you can um, identify it with a series of higher highs and higher lows and then my major direction is buys short term trades or scalps or sells as you can see here we have a corrective move uh, in a form of a sell as you can see here in we have a corrective move also and then also around this area here and then i'll show you like in the live chats how these things look and then we have like a corrective move also again here trying to create like a higher low around there and then what you do in the market is that you draw out like your overall structure uh, let's say you find it on the daily or the one hour chart and then after doing that you get like some type of a corrective move around this area here and then that corrective move is the one that will create like a higher low for you and then on that higher low that's where you look for buying opportunities let's say maybe you have like a major zone around this area here and then after getting that major zone that's where you can take like your buy opportunities around here and then trading in line with the uh, overall trend uh, can uh, be in your favor just because uh, whenever you take a buy around this area here and then maybe you're anticipating uh, for this high here as your overall take profit even if you forget about this trade uh, all you know is that you're trading in line with the overall trend up until the market changes direction and then breaks like the the low the higher low and then gives you like a lower low then you can uh look for selling opportunities and then as you can see here also you took the buy and then the market pushes to the upside gives you a corrective move in the form of a higher low and then you can look for another entry around this area here also and same thing goes on up until we break structure and then we have another corrective move and then I suggest everyone like uh, goes in line or trades in line uh, of the overall trend. If you get like a buy trend, focus on buying opportunities up until you master like your buying opportunities or you master like uh, trading in line with the trend. And then you can take like those corrective moves. And then let's say uh, the market reaches like this area around here. Let me just use this. The market reaches this area around here and then creates a double top for you to look for selling opportunities we have to break this higher low here after breaking the higher low we come back to create a lower high and then that's when the change of uh, direction is uh, completed the first things first you had like a double top in a form of a, reserve, a reversal candlestick pattern and then you have another reversal of which we break structure we come back and retest and then that is when we create a higher low around here. Let me just do this. That is when we create a higher low around here. Then the trend has changed. And you'll see that uh, in the live chats. I'll show you in the live chats. And then that is when you look for your selling opportunities, knowing that the change of our overall direction has been completed. And then you can see that by this higher low being printed out, and then this lower high being, being printed out and then the lower low being the higher low being broken and then you have like the overall change of uh the direction and then looking at the downtrend we have higher lows and then we have lower lows so we have lower highs and lower lows guys so this is the overall downtrend and then major direction is to the downside or it's uh, a sell and then short term trades or scalps are buying opportunities as you can see here the impulsive move is to the downside and then the overall corrective move is in a form of a buy so on this one you look for buying opportunities up until you get a change of direction so you look for buying opportunity selling opportunities let's say uh, you took a sell around this area here you took a sell around this area the market impulses with you and then creates a, a corrective move around here 
you can wait for a sell around this area after the break and a retest or you get a tight flag around this area knowing that you're trading in line with the markets or with the overall trend and then you get like another corrective move around here in a form of a uptrend or a short term uh, uptrend and then another short term uptrend around here up until you get like a double bottom around this area here to indicate that we are changing direction and then we break this lower high here after breaking the lower high that's when we create a higher low after creating the higher low in a form of a retest let me just do this in a form of a retest around this area here let me just remove a few things and then after we break like this lower high around here break the lower high and then we come back to retest the same area here and then we create a higher low and then after we create a higher low then we continue to the upside and then that is when you can change your direction and then you look for buy opportunities around this area here so let's look at like the charts and let me just show you what i was talking about So on the charts, we have a downtrend around this area here, and then we have an uptrend around this area here. So the examples that I was making on that uh, on those drawings that I made, let me just show you. Okay, so we have a downtrend as you can see here, and then we have that corrective move in the form of a buy. And then after that, we have a push to the downside. Then we have the corrective move in a form of a buy and then we have another impulsive move to the downside and then that and then this is where we break structure around this area here this is where we break structure and then formulate like another trend so this is where we broke structure and you can see that with this uh, candlestick area around here and then we go back to the downside create a higher low and after creating a higher low we create a higher high and then we go back to create a higher low again and then we have established like a trend to the upside and then uh, for those entries let me just do this and then for those entries like i said uh, in an uptrend you get like a corrective move in a form of a sell and then a and then the major direction is to the upside so as you can see here we got like that major direction to the upside and then uh, on the sell side let me check yeah so on the sell side this is where you get like a and then this uh this chart here is not like a picture perfect chart i chose like this uh chart here so that you can understand everything so we have like this a corrective move here in a form of a buy and then we got like uh, some type of a sensitive area around this area here and then you got like uh, the corrective move and then you get like the sell in a in, in an impulsive manner so yeah this is how you can trade like in line with the overall market structure and then let me just check uh, on the daily chart and then on the daily you can see uh, like you can see like the overall trend very clearly this is the overall trend the sell trend that i was talking about around here and then we broke structure after breaking structure then we come back and then create like higher highs and higher lows so yeah yes uh, this is it for today's video and then if you have like any questions you can drop them in the comment section i will gladly get to them one by one